And hello there guys and welcome back once again to the channel where today we are going to play a game called The Interview. Now I'm sure many of you are aware at the moment there's the big Steam summer sale on uh, for, for PC gaming and there is always so so many great offers uh, and so many great deals and I have got some of those deals. Um, but I also wanted to find like a, a horror game to get into. I, I've wanted to play a horror game on the, on the channel for quite a while. But I thought, you know what, I want to find something that's maybe not that good. So I decided to go by the user reviews and go for one that was sort of in the bottom 20 sort of worst horror games. And the interview was here. Um, I've just seen the trailer for it. It looks like it's going to be interesting. So let's, let's just get straight on with it. Let's press start. Fear is desire the other way around. Amado Nervo. Yes. What he Adam says. wanted Jesus a job. Christ. So he searched for one. You are kidding. He found one. This and today was his interview. No, Charlie, this He is... was curious about it. <laughs> Fucking hell. But he was even more curious <laughs> about that red little box at the end of the hallway. Wow. He intervie. Yes, he intervie. I can't believe the views like the the Microsoft. Adam Ritual, age twenty four. Please. Come in and sit in the red chair. Oh, we will attend to you in a minute. Okay, Mr. Robot Man. Jesus Christ! It, oh my God, that is so sensitive. I can't believe they used an actual like Microsoft Recorder Man thing. That is just ridiculous. Um, yeah, I can see why this has got a bad rating already, and I get the feeling this isn't going to be very, very scary. Well, it's probably going to be scary at how bad it is. How quickly is this door going to shut? Where has the door gone? Is there still music in the background? Can you still hear that music? Is it meant to be there? Can I click on this? Oh, Jesus. Okay, apparently we're on some kind of alien spaceship. Oh, it's a red button. Let me guess. Do I have to press it? Why is it off cent? Why is it so off center? I can't. So to press the red button, I have to be looking like. Oh, dear God. Hello, Adam. My name is oh, James and I will investigate a little about you. Let me start hello, with James. some questions and I will do some experiments to find out more about you. Any questions? Okay then. Yes, what the hell is going on? Uh, where are you? Why this chair? What kind of experiments? Uh, let's let's go with who the hell Where am I? That doesn't have to worry you. There is a small speaker in a corner. There I am. Well Adam, D how about if we start now? What? There's a small speaker in the corner, is there? Perfect. Okay, then. yes, let's, let's start. Let's start with an easy one. Are oh, you left-handed or right-handed? Right-handed. Uh, I am right-handed. Okay. Do you prefer black? Do oh you Oh my god, I've been taking the drugs again. Oh my god. Oh wait, wait, I'm not falling for that that trick. I am not falling for that trick. Um um, um back at Why do you look so serious? You look nervous. Here, take a glass of water. What? What? The, what? Is this even gonna be water? No. This um. Ah! Are you fine? You have to calm yourself. Was I know was you that may me be a screaming, nervous, or was that him just really overpronouncing the, the air in Adam? Please, take a seat and relax. Okay, can I take your seat? I don't want so, to take this seat anymore. do you believe in a god? Or don't you believe in anything? Well, that's the different question. Do you believe in a god, or don't you believe in anything? If I don't believe in anything, I don't believe in na or existence or anything. Um... So, I do believe, in that case, I'm going to have to go with that, because I do believe in something. I believe in miracles, for a start. Uh, so, let's go you with see? that. You see? That wasn't that difficult. You just have to choose. Nothing weird, right? Next one. Well, apart from all the Education other Education, or friendship. Uh, I am going to go, James, with friendship. Next one. Money, all right. or love. Definitely love. I love money, but no, no, I'm definitely. Let's go, go with difficult ones. 
Would you prefer okay, ignorance let's and go happiness with difficult ones. or knowledge and sadness? Uh, ignorance and happiness. All Three day more. long. Work a lot and get paid a lot, or work a little bit and get paid less? I'm all for work and getting the money for it, so Die yep, standing as that. a hero, or live on your knees as a slave? Uh, uh, well, it's that it's a difficult one. Why is this turned into that weird online game that people have been playing recently? Either or. Um, well, you get a lot. Yeah, but you won't be alive to see the thing, and it, but you've done a good thing. But being a slave all your life, is it really worth living? Let's Last go one. Hero. Adam, okay, know your James. future without emotion, or not to know. Not to know, because that's how we live now, and it's. I don't want to know my future, because then that just. Very good, it. Adam. First part Thank is you. ended. Now, take your time to relax, and we will proceed to the next experiment. I get. I thought this was an interview. I don't want to go. What am I even being interviewed for? I've just kicked my bin over. What, what am I even being interviewed for? For. The, some. Uh, okay, let's go. Um, why, what, this is weird, I don't even know if, can I even put some of this on YouTube? Uh, yeah, this, I might have to blur this out somehow, because this is, um, this is a bit wrong, don't, this, this isn't even a bit wrong, this is very wrong. I know that was hard to see, or at least to me. Adam, All right, what do you feel about that? Uh, uh, bored. I was really bored with that. Let, let's go with bored. Boredom? Yes. Interesting. Okay, Adam. What about starting the last round of questions? Yeah, let's go. Yeah. Gun. D knife. <laughs> knife. Gun. I think you see you've played Knifey Spoonie before. Um, I, uh, well... I use a knife when I'm cooking stuff, and I don't like guns, so I'm going to go with knife. Um, so, I can see why this has got such a low rating, um, due to the... You are doing very well. Okay, I'm blurry. Congratulations. Next one. And that's a really... Murderer? Victim? Um, I'd probably be the... Well, it depends what I, I... I mean, if I was chopping flowers up, that's technically murder. Or, like, stabbing a tree. I don't have to, I'd rather not be the victim. Mind you, it didn't say that I'd die. Oh, I'll go with that. What the hell is going on now? Fantastic job. Oh, Adam, this is let's weird. See. Would you cut your leg for your best friend's life? Would I cut my leg for my best friend's life? Well, it doesn't say cut it off. It just says cut it, so I'm going to say yes. Adam, that is you so to jail. loud. Don't continue to this. If, if someone, someone killed, killed your mother, mother would you, you kill, kill him or would he make, make suffer for his whole life? life? I, I, suffer? Why not? What does that even say? Would, would you, you kill your mother if she tries to kill you? you? Yes or yes. Well, I'm gonna, I suppose, have to just, like, disappear right now. This is a very unnerving experience. Um, does that, is that same mother upside down? Oh, God, the box is back. I'm so glad that I spent money on this. Um... Adam. I this is the last question of all. I can't look around anymore. Do you know something about this red little box? Yes. No. Are you alright? No. I'm playing this game. Of course I'm not alright. This is so... Messed up. Um. Is something gonna... No. I was expecting something to jump up at me then. I'm not gonna lie. I'm still kind of expecting that to happen. Can I go? Am I? Oh, I'm free. Oh, I'm free to go. Oh, and it's the, it's very Willy Wonkery. Um, 
Is this star just going to keep getting further away? No, no, it is actually working as a door. Oh, of course, the yellow room. Why, why the hell not? Um, confess. Oh, God, we're getting Game of Thrones on the right here. Um, do I want to use a saw or a rusty knife? I don't know what, what's all this here. What's all that there? All right, let's use the knife then. Not a job. Eight, mum, one. Murder, confession, truth, knife, interrogate, saw. There's a thing that, all right, I meant to go this way then, I guess. Why is it so slow? This is really a very strange experience. It's been so poorly done. Little red, no, red little box. Adam inside, I'm inside the box. Of course I am, of course I am. That makes perfect sense. I'm not even called Adam, that is not my name. This is just so, what, how can people get away with stuff like this? It's what I don't understand. Oh, I'm back here. Wait, I'm in, press one to get up. Have I been interviewing myself? Oh, oh, look at that grass, wowzers. Um, so this, this is beautiful. Yeah, I'm very impressed with what you're doing with the place. Oh, you can even hear the join of the sound. Hang on. Just wait for it to come back. There it is. They can't even find the sound long enough to go. Oh, my God. Oh, no. Nope, didn't think it was going to be that simple. Oh, my God. It's a really weird version of deal or no deal. Um. Okay, so we've got a float one. So we've got... Where is, where is your head? Ooh, so sad your head, so you, um, well I'm guessing it's, hang on, let's get this centred somehow, shall we? No, is that not going to work? Adam Ridgewell was charged for murdering eight people, including his mother, Marlin, and beheading them with a knife. He kept them in a, okay, he was interrogated to prove that he was sick in the head, maybe he will confess all his crimes. Adam suffered frequent hallucinations that made clear his instability. He was sent to an asylum. He heard what he wanted to hear. He didn't want to know what that he was sick or he couldn't. That wasn't an interview. He wasn't looking for a job. He was being interrogated. Adam became a famous murderer because he always kept his victim's head inside the same little place. Let me guess. Is it a red box? Adam that... wanted a job. So he searched for one. He found one. And yes. today was his interview. He was curious about it. But he was even more curious about that red little box at the end of the hallway. <sighs> now, I think I've learned a valuable lesson um, in playing this. Um, don't buy any games <laughs> Gene Kelly singing in the rear. Um, yeah, don't buy games that are really low down on Steam in user ratings. There's a reason they're there, folks. Oh, oh, it's not over. That's it. Let's just try and deafen everyone with fucking sound and literally possibly the worst gaming experience I have ever had in my life <laughs>